a wanderer comes my way, walking the sands upon which this poor shell must suffer. Call me Ishmael, son of the sea, an outcast upon these wretched shores, an exiled shell doomed to live under a canopy of arid sky, not his native tender water. Of course I can talk. Don't be silly. There's more tongue to me than heart. Indeed, the surprise should be mine, for I still remember the days when your kind swung from branches and plucked the vermin out of their neighbor's fur. Oh. Time is an indulgent mistress to one who spends happy hours as she passes. But when your existence is one of misery, she becomes a lethargic hum. Oh, I remember ancient times, for I have lain here since antiquity, when the ruins around us were palaces and the sun-bleached dead merry children. All this I have seen, alive, alone, alas. My fate is a cruel one, I assure you. How many snot noses have held me up against their dirty little ears, only to claim they can hear the ocean? Of course they can hear her, the brats. We are on the very edge of the great aquatic mother whose embrace I so desperately long for. Yes, yes, I, King of Pearls, ache to repose anew on his coral throne. Hurl me toward the water. Swing me as far as your arm strength gives lease, and treasure long sunk, I will grant thee. What do you say, kind knight? Will you return the King of Pearls to the sea, so he may yield you long lost treasure? Agreed. Let's send him home. Liberator, kind benefactor! Bless me the might of your sea-bound witch. The sea, the sea, I have returned, where every wave feels like a perfect sea. May the bounty of the deep be yours.